This is question five from a series of videos taking a look at the Edexcel practice papers. Here we're told that there are 18 packets of sweets and 12 boxes of sweets in a carton. Then we're told that the mean number of sweets in all the 30 packets and boxes is 14. So what, we, what that means is that the mean of the 18 packets and the 12 boxes would be 14. Then we're told that the mean number of sweets in the 18 packets is 10. Then we're asked to work out the mean number of sweets in the boxes. Now, in order to work this out, the mean number of sweets in the boxes, I know that there are 12 boxes, but I don't know how many sweets are in those boxes. So what I need to do is I need to try and figure out what the total number of sweets, the total number of sweets is in the boxes. So I know that that divided by 12 is going to give me the answer that I'm looking for. All that I need to do is figure out, well, what is the total number of sweets in those boxes? So to figure that out, I've got this information here. I know that the mean number of sweets in the 18 packets is 10. So what I can say is that um, the total number of sweets divided by the 18 packets is given an answer of 10. So that means that the total number of sweets, which I'm just calling X, would be 180. Okay, so the total sweets in the packets is 180. Then what I need to do is I need to figure out, well, if I know what the sweets in the packets are, and I know what the mean for the packets and the boxes is, then I can figure out what just this number of sweets in the boxes will be. So here I can just do exactly the same thing again. So I know that the number in total of the packets and the boxes divided by 30. And perhaps here we'll just use a different letter just to signify that this is a different equation. X divided, uh, sorry, Y divided by 30 is going to give me 14. OK, so the total number of sweets then is just going to be 30 times by 14. Uh, and that's going to give me an answer of um, 420. So in answer to my question, I now know that there were 420 in 420 sweets in the packets and the boxes. I know that there were 180 in just the packets, which means that the total number of sweets, what I'm trying to find out here, is going to be 420 minus 180. So what I can say is that that's going to give me an answer of 240. And then that means that I'm going to do 240 divided by 12, and that's going to give me an answer of 20. So the mean number of sweets in the boxes is going to be 20.